I would like a good amount of energy for this next gentleman. I think you guys all know who he is. He is one of my closest friends. He is one of the funniest guys in the country. You know him and you love him. The great Patrice O'Neill. Comfortable as all fuck. I ain't gonna lie to you. Can you hear this? Can you hear me? Don't ever stand up like that again. All the white people standing up like that, fucking from Jersey, nigga. We think I'm falling for the banana in the tailpipe. Like we love you, nigga. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, we love this nigga. We ain't vote for Barack, but Patrice. Thank you, Lemmy, for bringing me out to music I've never heard Anytime. before. Anytime. I tell you, I jerked off. Let me, I, jer I jerked off to something that I wasn't proud of. It just was creepy. Now, you ever go on an internet porno journey where you just click on your first box, but you just keep clicking until you're like 50 clicks in? <laughs> so you, you almost like if it was, if, it, if you was in outer space, you'd be lost. You know what I'm saying? Like, like you go, oh shit, I can't get back to the first fucking box that I clicked. So you stuck. So I had clicked so many boxes that I got to an Asian porn site and it was so Asian, it was like theirletters.com, like it was like squiggly line, circles, <laughs> flowers and a house.com and shit. <laughs> and here's how fucked up, it was just two women in a bathtub uh, squirting uh, titty milk on each other. And that wasn't even the shit that made me jerk off because they weren't going, ooh, ooh yeah, titty milk. One would squirt and another one would go, so you, <laughs> you have a jerk off, but you ashamed? Like I was like, oh shh. <laughs> Another thing I'm getting creepy, I'm starting to like young broads, man. Like really, it's starting to bother me. I ain't no pedophile or no shit like that, but god damn it. If I drive by a high school when it's letting out, I gotta put one of them things you put on dogs to keep them from licking themselves when they have a surgery. Cause I don't wanna feel like a piece of shit looking at a young broad, man. Like, God damn. I mean, it, it, because quite frankly, when you get older, like, it, it, older women, eh, no offense, but you know, the price of pussy is like, it's like cars, it ain't like houses. It goes down in value. In no country for old pussy, Jack. <laughs> no thank you, friendo. I'm not fucking that. But I'm not saying that old is bad just in terms of old. In context, meaning old women like over 30. <laughs> over 30, seriously, who dick tease? Like, you ever meet a, a woman who goes, no, thank you, I don't want to. You'd be like, look, an 18, 19-year-old can do that shit. I can go grab a 19-year-old titty, and she's like, stop, don't grab that, quit. <laughs> and I'm happy, too. I'm, like, giggling, like, why? I don't want to. I don't want to. Why not? A... I don't want to stop. I just want to touch it. Why not? I don't want to. <laughs> I got some candy. Go get the candy. Get the candy. <laughs> why not I get the candy? And we're just all giggling and having a fun time with the 19-year-old. I tried to buy my girl one of those little 19-year-old outfits, like the schoolgirl outfits. I said, put this on, baby. Mmm, you're looking good. Now giggle. She's like, huh. <laughs> I'm like, what happened to your giggling? You can't giggle no more. I'm trying. <laughs> Just take your drawers off, you old bitch. Just fucking pull them down. I wish I had a vagina for like a day, just to see what, you know. I know if I had a pussy, the value of it would go down tremendously, because I'd give everybody some pussy, everybody. <laughs> just for giving me tap water. Ooh, thank you, you got me some tap water with no ice here, come, uh, uh. <laughs> It must be a terrible fucking burden to have one. It starts early, too. You ever see them talk shows where they have the bad girls on? Like the bad 13-year-olds and 14-year-olds and Maury's like, come on out, Sally. 
And Sally got big ass titties. She smoked a cigarette. She's like, I suck dick, Maury. And, <laughs> and the mother's in the back crying. <laughs> Maury, I can't stop her from sucking dick. She won't stop sucking dick. And the crowd's booing, boo! Fuck y'all, y'all don't know me. And she shows a buzzy. <laughs> Shut up, bitch, stop crying. I'm fuck out. <laughs> we gave Sally a lie detector test. We asked her if she sucked 20 dicks when she got here. She, she said yes. The lie detector test determined that was a lie. She sucked 40 dicks when she got here. And she's all out of control, crazy, horny and shit. Then they got to have this little black dude come out and curse at her. Little uh, D. West motherfucker look like a superhero. He come out with his, his she has a sweater, but the, the sleeves are cut off. And, and he tucks it in his pants. And it, so he has like a wife beater sweater. And he just comes out and he's cursing out your daughter. Stop sucking dick. I said, stop sucking dick. And she's like, I suck dick if I want to suck dick. Shut up! I said, stop sucking dick. Come on, I'm taking you on a dick sucking uh, journey uh, to stop sucking dick. Like, <laughs> takes it to a funeral home. And, uh, you know, look at her, she's dead. You see that dead corpse? She's dead. Because she wouldn't stop sucking dick. You see her? <laughs> she's dead because she won't stop sucking dick. Take it to a woman's prison, some bitch with a sharpened toothbrush got a fucking thing on the. Yeah, yeah I'm in here for 30 years for sucking dick. You want to keep sucking dick? You want to be here with me for 30 years? <laughs> and there's some 13-year-old boy somewhere going, I wish somebody would suck my dick. I, I don't... <laughs> hey, I got to go, man. Y'all take care of yourself. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Thank you. Patrice O'Neill. For all your comedians, 